Stephen has a really great song uh, called Find the Cost of Freedom. Really. Except that sometimes I would sing Find the Coast of Sweden. <laughs> and that was okay, except when I did it on stage, by mistake. Possibly I was confused. <laughs> But I bet Nash that I hadn't sung it. I said, no, man. He said, yeah, you sang Fine Coast of Sweden. I said, no, I didn't. Any kids here? No kids? I fucking didn't. <laughs> Cost me a thousand dollars. He didn't even bother to cash the check. He framed it. <laughs> Lesson B, just what he said, don't bet English people. So there's six, oh, that's it for the hits. We're done. Okay, maybe a couple at the end. Uh, this next song, I owe a debt to our friend Jackson Brown. He's a good man, our Jack. And uh, he uh, came over to a house where I was uh, kind of hibernating. <laughs> uh, I think that's a nice way to put it. <laughs> and uh, I showed him some words to the song that I was working on. And uh, he said, Cross, this is, this is good. You, you need to finish this. I said, I don't have a piano, man. <laughs> or something like that. And he said, uh, I'll kick it in the car. And he drove me over to Warren Seafine's house. <laughs> Thankfully, Warren wasn't there, or I would have been intimidated. Uh, he sat me down at Warren's piano, and he said, OK, finish the song. And then he wouldn't let me get up uh, and go do anything else <laughs> until I finished the fucking song. Uh, it's a song about choice and chance. <laughs> 